welcome to my channel. Today I'm really excited because I have a super fun video to show you guys. I have a haul of all the stuff I bought when I went to the SM Town and Store on my recent trip to Korea. I am so excited. There was, amazingly, an SM Town and Store next to my hotel located in the Seoul Design Plaza and I quickly took my little butt over there and purchased so many things <laughs> that you can see here. Um, so let's just uh, start unboxing. Let's start with the NCT Sanrio collab stuff. Okay. The store. Okay. Let me just start real quick. The store full of NCT stuff. If you are an N citizen, a Susanie, you would be literally so happy because I was so happy because NCT stuff was everywhere. There was an entire wall in the store dedicated to the Sanrio collab with the NCT members. They had, I think, every single merch that has dropped besides like the PJs there. Um, a lot of it was sold out for lots and lots of members, like for these roll stickers, this was the only thing that 10 was not sold out in. So of course I bought it because he is my ult and the pens were super limited. I think there were only like six or seven members left, but it was awesome. I just like a wall of NCT merch made all of my <laughs> dreams come true. Um, but I did pick up these two things. I picked up the gel pen and the roll stickers. I got Xiao Jun in the roll pen just because I thought his was really, really cute. I love Xiao Jun and this blue color was just really speaking to me. So he is Cinema Rolls, friend gel pen, super cute teacup, um, but the pen's just this very pretty blue color. It says Cinema Roll Xiao Jun NCT 2022 with Sanrio and he has the cutest little oh my gosh I can't even handle it very cute very excited to have this be my purse pen I'm living <laughs> um, and next the other thing I got from this collab was tens roll stickers I initially didn't buy these because I didn't think I needed them when it released and gomes were opening up for it but then I saw them in store and I just thought they were so cute Here's all the different designs that you can get. I love the one where he's hugging Karomi. Karomi, I think is how you pronounce it. And they got their little wings, matching wings. So cute. I can't wait to use these in trades and sales. And I hope I actually use them and not just get afraid of hoarding and collecting. So these are the two Sanrio merch items I picked up and I am thrilled. <laughs> Next, speaking of NCT, I picked up Ten's Love Letter Earrings. They had a small-ish display of all the Love Letter Earrings. Um, they only really had like a couple of NCT members left and I think like a couple of EXO members and I think just like Wendy from Red Velvet left. Their Love Letter merch was super dwindled understandably because it's so cute. I can't believe 10 was left. I was thrilled. These, I think, these came out originally for Valentine's Day earlier this year with like maybe some necklaces too. I'm not entirely sure, but they are just these two hoop earrings with two little hearts. One is an open heart and another is full with just a little T for 10 embossed on it. Super cute. And then I think this is in his handwriting. It says, I can't live without you. He is a very dramatic boy after all, but he is the best boy. <laughs> I'm very excited to have these earrings. I am thrilled on the back of the full heart. It says NCT, which I will be wearing that in the back. So no one knows. These are my secret 10 earrings and no one in my real life will know I am wearing K-pop merch, but I will know. It's like this Taemin ring, I swear. I'm like, Oh my gosh, it's a really cute ring that I found and I really like it. Anyway, very excited with my love letter earrings. Happy, happy, happy purchase. <laughs> and much cheaper buying it in Seoul than buying it in Seoul and shipping it to a gome and then shipping it to me. So next is the thing I was most excited about. Like when you walked into the store, 
the shiny section was the first thing you saw. It was like right by the door, like right in the front, in the middle, and I bolted to it. Sadly, they literally, I think the shiny and the wavy <laughs> sections were the least stocked sections in the entire store, but you know, you win some, you lose some. This was a major win because when I got over there, there was a little basket full of six or seven of these little uh, Kung dolls that Taemin did. And by the time I like looped around the store seven minutes later, they were all gone. So I'm very, very happy with my timing and very happy to have this. Let's just open this. This is, again, the Kung keychain from the merch that Taemin released as a farewell. I'm joining the ARMY merch release. He said he wanted to do this so that Shawls and Taemin's could have something to, I guess, remember him by. Um, I was so sad when this initially launched because I couldn't buy anything just due to where I was where I was at in life. So to see just a small fraction of it available in store for me to purchase and to actually get my hands on it is so, so happy. This is a little Kung, his cat, his baby, his daughter, and it comes with a little cheese addition to the keychain. Um, it says Tay, Mary, and Kung. So cute as an entertainment with this very cute little flip through. I can't read it. It's in Korean. I'm sorry. But I am very excited to put this on something. I will have to decide and figure out what it deserves to be put on because it's just too cute. Okay. And last but not least is my only album that I purchased. I already took the saran wrap off of it so I wouldn't be annoying, but it is Red Velvet's Automatic album. I love this album. It's their debut album. So, so good. One of my favorites for sure. Probably my second favorite Red Velvet album of all time. They were fully stocked on all of their albums, except for my favorite album, which is, I believe, The Velvet? I don't know. I'll put it on the screen, but they were fully stocked and I had to pick this up. I am so excited to own it. Ah, it is so beautiful. This CD is a gorgeous. Oh my gosh, let's see if I can get it out with the birds. I love that. Stunning. And you have their names and the girls. This is just a fantastic album. My, I think Automatic is my favorite Red Velvet song of all time. Their vocals are just heavenly. I really do love the Velvet side of Red Velvet. They can really sing and oh my gosh, my favorite comebacks are always like the really monochromatic ones. Like when they all have this, <laughs> oh my god, they're poles. <laughs> Hold on, let me hide these poles. <laughs> Okay, for some reason, I thought it didn't come with photo cards. That's fine. Um, what was I saying? Oh, yeah, okay, when they all had the blonde hair, so like, absolutely destroyed, killed. Something kind of crazy is so good, but the blonde hair just suits them all so well. I love when groups go full blonde. Like, look at Wendy. Look at her. She looks so good. Enjoy. Also... Okay, Ice Cream Cake, top three titles, I think, for Red Velvet for me. It is just phenomenal. That chorus goes so hard out of seemingly nowhere, and the creepy la la la's, fantastic. What more could you need exactly? Love, love, love Ice Cream Cake in this album. Truly a phenomenal album. The Girls Ate, and way to come out of the gate swinging. Okay, um, let's go through my polls, question mark. Uh, first, <laughs> hide the photo card is this ad. Super cool. Next, my card. Dun, 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 dun. Okay, is it upside down? Maybe three, two, one. Oh my god! Is this, <laughs> is that Irene? Or... I think it's Irene. Hold on, hold on. Yes? My girl? Joy? No, Yeti? Who, whom's is this? I am so bad with signatures. Like, I love Red Velvet and 
I think this is Irene. I'll double check. But oh my gosh, so cool. I love, you can tell how old it is because it has the like not for sale and then the http colon slash slash redvelvet.smtown.com at the bottom. That's so funny. She's a, she's a vintage photo card, but this is so stunning. I love the bird like on the, uh, the signature. That's so cute. I'm so happy with this poll. I think that's it. Yeah. Oh my gosh. So happy to own this album. Will definitely be good for the winter, you know, like winter vocal vibes. I think so. But that's it for everything I bought at the SM Town and Store. Um, on my little trip to Seoul. Very excited. Wish I picked up more, quite honestly. I thought I'd be going to the SM Museum. Turns out that's permanently closed, so if you were planning on going, I'm very sorry. So that's, that's a bummer, but hopefully they bring that back, and it was a fantastic trip, and I am so happy, and I just feel very grateful in life right now. <laughs> um, but that's the end of the video. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you take care and you have a great rest of your day, your night, wherever you are. And stay happy, stay healthy. 